we have Easy FC are trying to read the the kits, and it's the start of this game. We don't have. While Steven is uh, getting some ice, I think we're still streaming here at Poyatan Cup 2019. This is between Telos FC and Easy FC. We're trying to identify which of the teams are. Um, and then we almost had the shot. Female player losing it. Now we have a throw in. I think I'd like to believe that. No, I can't make assumptions for this one. And we have a throw in. Let me just check which is which. I can't read the the teams from what they are wearing, but we have an attempt curled. We'll get back to you figuring out who are play who's playing who. Tell us FC playing uh, wearing red playing left to right and easy FC playing right to left. Welcome back, Steven. Uh, thank you very much, Glenn. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> no I worries. I to get some uh, quick refreshments. Uh, Easy FC actually is another one, uh, actually a similar group like Kickstart. Uh, they also play at Sparta FC. Uh, they specialize, of course, in uh, teaching beginners, mm -hmm. teaching them the fundamentals of the game. So uh, they're actually kind of like our neighbors in Sparta since we're also <laughs> there a lot of the, the time. You fill up the calendar. <laughs> yeah, they're actually, schedule. if I remember their schedule, they're there every Monday. Uh, oh, Monday. Of course, Kickstart were there every Wednesday and Saturday. So again, if you guys are looking for somewhere to play, uh, somewhere to learn the, the game of football, <laughs> uh, you can definitely check them out. Easy Football FC. It's always nice to have them. They, they're usually a join. Uh, they always join our tournaments. Uh, sometimes they even join our sessions at uh, Sparta. Yes, Julius Campos, Carlo Dud Santos. Ito yon. Kung ano man yon, ito nga yon. <laughs> Easy FC on the attack. Nice cross. So, oh, just missing That's ball a control. Golden chance yeah. right there. You can see the the regret <laughs> from. Oh yeah. <laughs> just missed time that there a little bit. That. Oh, we need the ball here. Oh. Villa. Oh. Villarica, um, the keeper of Easy FC, I think, plays for uh, Stallion Laguna. I think, oh if nice. I remember correctly. Nice little fun fact there. If I'm right. If you're correct. <laughs> yeah. correct. Fun fact, if you're correct. <laughs> Just not the men's team. Not the men's team, definitely. Because that's not allowed here, right? <laughs> oh. Easy FC on the attack. All right, here they Oh, it's snuffed out, and that's gonna be a goal kick. The the ball's really fast. One one uh, skill that I don't see a lot is covering. On like the defensive uh, yeah, side. Yeah, on the defensive side. Well, again, a, a lot of these goals, it seems like uh, the defense is really just getting caught off guard. <laughs> you know, the, again, the pace is very fast. Mm -hmm. Just a little bit. Tell us on the attack. Nice save. Ooh. Oof. I think the kick hit the the player over here. Goal kick. 
We have a goal kick for uh, Easy FC. Can a keeper actually score a goal? No, a keeper can. Once the ball is in play, the only time uh, they can score, of course, uh, off the kickoff, they have to have it touched first. So oh, one okay. person has to touch it. It has to be a two-touch. But, uh, for example, if the keeper has the ball in play and if he wants to take a shot, yeah, he can do so. Just not from a goal kick? No, even from ah, a goal even kick, Even from yes. a goal kick, okay. The only situations you can not score here is off a throw-in and, of course, off the goal kick. Uh, off a, a, what is it? A Free uh, kick? Free kick, yes. An indirect free kick. Yes, uh, indirect yeah, free uh, kick. Uh, so anything indirect and anything off the kickoff has to be two-touch. Oh, okay. Oh. Ooh, a little too rough there for the ref's liking. Steven building his resume. <laughs> and we have a free kick a bit far from the, the goal. But let's see how they will play this one. That's a good ball in. Oh, I almost thought that went <laughs> in. Yeah, upper right hand corner. Just a little too to the right. Guys, say hi if you're still watching with us. We appreciate you yeah. watching. So our 10 viewers, uh, thank you so much for tuning in. Let us know um, why you aren't here. <laughs> you guys <laughs> should be here. Or which team you're rooting for. Yeah, exactly. We have some supporters, I think, of Pan FC, mm -hmm. Superbad FC. Again, 24 teams, so a lot to choose from. And Puyatan Cup. Yes, Everyone is watching. <laughs> yes. Support, so supporting Puyatan Cup 2019. All right, but checking in with this game, of course, uh, Teles FC versus Easy FC still locked at 0-0. But it might change here. Teles FC with the ball in a dangerous position. Oh, oh, right over the goal. Let's see, he gets it right in front of the box, just lifts it up too high. Again, you know, sometimes accuracy is way better than power right there. Just a little too much. Mm -hmm. And you can see some of our other teams hanging out. Maybe their their game, their next game is here. I mean, that's the one thing that's nice here again about Puyatan. It's not really hot, you know. You can just kind of hang out. You don't have to worry about oh. the oh, Oof. a rough play here. It looks like we have a possible. Was oh, it a slide tackle? I think I saw a slide. A little too rough. No card though from the ref. Again, a reminder, no sliding is allowed. And of course, at the ref's discretion, he can give a card, whether it be yellow or red. If it's red, like Glenn mentioned, <laughs> you have to pay the price, literally 500 pesos. Because I've seen the the fines for uh, professional league or semi-professional leagues, and they're pretty expensive. Oh, yeah, <laughs> of course. This is just a drop in the bucket compared to like professional fees. And, and uh, one of the, the what's this? One of the effects of the the red card is that you can't play the next game. That's right. And that will be like the week after or something. Well, no, not only that, uh, you know, Oof. you kind of put your team at a advan uh, disadvantage, true. of course. Because you'll, you'll be one man yeah, down. Yeah, of course. Well, with a red card in football, the player has to go off the field. And not only that, he can't come back, so and you'll be down a player. We see one of the teams playing... Uh, I don't know, Rondo, but with just headers over <laughs> Yeah, I think they're just warming up. A little keep keep up right there. Warming up their uh, lungs too uh, <laughs> but while laughing at each other, I guess. <laughs> Straight to the keeper. Tell us FC with the attack. Again. Oh, th oh, oh, that is a goal right there. First one of this game going to Tell us FC. They strike first. Let's see if we can get a replay of that. The keeper was able to get a hand on it, but it was not enough. It goes in that top left corner right there. Telus FC going up one and nil to Easy FC. We have one of the best seats in the house right here. Yep. It's an awesome goal. Just under three minutes remaining, and uh, <coughs> all right, Easy FC now on the back foot. They're gonna have to get something going here. They're down one nil, just under, under two minutes and thirty seconds left in this game. Mm -hmm. Again, 12-minute game. Yeah, so it's going to go by quick. So once you play... Oop, that, there was a push right there. <laughs> so once you play a 12-minute game, you Here we go. There goes another oh. shot. Oh! And the rebound is in just like that. Dallas FC going up 2-0 on Easy FC. The female player right there getting the goal for Telus. 
doubling their advantage right now. So you can call that a rebound. Yeah, so but a turnover you can't call a turnover <laughs> for for football. Uh, that's a little yeah, a little yeah. different on the terminology. Probably a change of possession. Yeah. You know, just because it, it doesn't change. Ah, no, it changes it really often. Well, I mean, the goalie tried his best to keep it, you know, in control, but mm -hmm. he just couldn't keep it. It was <laughs> the player was right there at the right place in the right time. Tell us, FC again up to a minute and a half remaining. Hey, we have a score on the other field. Uh, I see Dion. Oh, oh, we have a... Oh, almost. And Just like that, tell us on the counter. The shoot. Straight to the keeper. Easy FC still trying to convert. Nice cross for Telos, but straight to the keeper inside All the right, box. checking the clock. Just under a minute left in this game. Hopefully, we're synced with the referee. Yes, hopefully we are. And oh, oh, another save. I think Telos FC really making the keeper of easy work. <laughs> but he's working really well just for that two goals uh, off a rebound. Oh. It looks like we're in the dying seconds of this game. Telos might be moving on to a 2-0 victory right here. It's a really exciting game, actually. Mm -hmm. A lot of shots. Uh, sadly, though, most of the shots coming from Dallas' side. <laughs> they just couldn't uh, convert, at least for the other side. Oh, is he wasting time? Uh, I don't think they would want to do that right <laughs> now. It would not be in their advantage. All right, ball coming Oops. in. Let's you see, the ref see is looking at his clock right now. Could be blowing the whistle any second oh. now. Long ball. Attempt. And Time. there it is. Oh, Final we are whistle. Synchronized with the referee. Tell us FC getting the win at two. Easy FC zero. Right here at field Let's one. See that first goal from Telus FC. And uh, the second one. Just a rebound. There we go. Yes, the rebound from the female player. In the right place at the right time, getting that one. Yep. And that's the end of Group B matches here on Field 1.